gotta do So why do we do this dance? Are we moving too slow? Cause you need reassurance Don't conflate issues Why you always jump to Hello lovely people, big warm welcome back to my channel. How is everyone? Hope everyone is doing really well watching this today. Yes, I am sat on my kitchen floor. I have not lost my mind, not yet anyway. I promise I'm here for a reason because this little cupboard to my left is getting a serious sort out today. So for today's Motivation Monday video, I'm going to be organizing my kitchen sink cupboard, under sink cupboard which I use as a cleaning cupboard. I actually have a much bigger cleaning cupboard upstairs, which also needs a massive sort out, but this is my daily sort of like grab and go cupboard. And it is neglected, it is messy, things are piling up, and it's about time I really, really sort it out. I have got some new storage bits that I'm gonna use, and we're just gonna give it a clean and a sort out together. I love watching stuff like this. Am I normal? So hopefully you guys like watching stuff like this too. I think it's really normal to enjoy watching stuff like this. So yeah, guys, happy Motivation Monday. Let's organize my kitchen cupboard together. <laughs> Get yourself a cup of tea and enjoy. Do I really want you? When you know that so this was my starting point it's kind of just become a bit of a dumping ground I've just been chucking stuff in here and I kind of lost all system <laughs> that I had in there originally so the first thing I'm going to do is just empty it completely I'm going to take everything out so I can actually decide what I need to keep in there and what can go and I'm also going to give it a really good clean before I put anything back in there as well Jump so to clean it, I'm just going to use these flash wipes just to give it a wipe down and get rid of any scum or anything that's come off the cleaning products or the bottles and that's built up on the surfaces. So now on to storage, I have a few of these lovely clear acrylic storage things that I got from B&M, they were a really lucky find in the clearance aisle, so I've got a few of those, I've also got these cutlery holders that I just got for like a pound on Amazon, they're going to be great for holding up my cleaning things that need to be upright. I also have this large cleaning caddy that I've had for a while and she is so helpful. I think I found her in B&M and then I got the label from Etsy and then a couple more of these stackable storage things down the bottom as well. Like I said, these cutlery storage things are going to be great for my cleaning items that need to be upright, such as scrubbers and brushes and my dish matics and things like that. It's a perfect way to store them and my sonic scrubber, anything like that that needs to be stood upright rather than lying down, these are going to be so perfect. On the top shelf here, using these clear acrylic containers, I'm going to put in my cleaning cloths. So I want one that is just blue. I always use blue to clean the toilets, blue for the loo, which I learned from Emily Norris years ago. So I'm just gonna put blue ones in this one, and then in the other one, I will put a range of the other colored cleaning cloths I have as well. It's yours, it's yours, it's yours. My love just rest assured. I'm yours, I'm yours, tell me what you're running for, you don't have to try I've gone through all my products and decided what I want to keep in my caddy. This caddy is really everyday essential cleaning items, the things that you really use most days. So I've gone through and decided what is worthy of being in my cleaning caddy and I'm going to pop them all inside. And as for the two organizers down here, I'm going to put a couple of my super absorbent sponges in the bottom one here that I use for dusting. And then I'm going to put all of my spare plugins and bathroom fresheners in the top one here. Inside. 
There's also a couple of spare things like fairy liquid and stuff like that that I'm just going to put behind. Things that I really need to be in there but don't necessarily need to be able to grab every single day. But there you go. It really didn't take me long at all and I'm so happy with the result. None of the storage in here costs more than like two or three pounds. So it's all really low budget and it looks so much more organized and has a good system to it and will really help with my daily cleaning. But thank you so much for watching guys I hope you enjoyed it don't forget to subscribe before you go and I'll see you in my next video